Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 18 player review on my channel. So in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing end of era 91 rated SBC Pirlo. So this SBC will cost you around 40,000 coins to complete if you don't have anything in your club. Otherwise, you should be able to do it for cheaper, and you could even potentially do this for free, because all that you need is an 83 rated team with, I think it's two MLS players in, um, so the requirements are very, very cheap um, for the rating of card you do get. So getting to this guy's first pro now, what is his long shots? This guy has really, really good long shots. I did actually review his footmas card yesterday, and that was probably one of the biggest um, differences I could tell between these two cards, was how much better this guy was at taking long shots than his footmas card. So after that, the next pro I could find with this card was his dribbling. Now, I think this has um, a big reason to do with his control. Um, you know, he keeps the ball so close to his feet when dribbling, and he does it like... Um, like he's really hard to dispossess just because he keeps it so close to his body um, he doesn't really run the fastest but you know he's really good at change on direction um, when defenders are trying to get the ball off him because his dribbling is so good and then the final pro what probably is the biggest selling point of this card and that is how good this guy's passing is um, he only managed to get me one assist in the six games I did play with him um, but the amount of times you know he he um, played the ball through to my strikers was incredible. You know, he's so accurate and probably could have had at least three or four assists if my uh, strikers were more clinical. Now, getting to this guy's con now, the first con with this card is his stamina. Now, this is probably um, the biggest down point with this card. That's how bad this guy's stamina is. It's around 50, I think. So, you know, this guy gets tired really, really quickly. So, eventually, um, after half time or around the 60th minute mark, you will have to take him off unless you do um, apply a fitness card to him every single match. And then the next con I could find with this card was his two-star skill moves. Now, I didn't actually include this as the cons in his footmas review. Um, and I'm not really sure why, to be honest, because I played this guy in camp for a match, and I really found that it was limited what he could do, just because he only had the two-star skill moves. So the only thing he could really do is, you know, receive the ball, and then either play the ball through. We couldn't really perform any skill moves um, to beat defenders, so that was one con um, with this card. Um, but overall, I would say I would definitely recommend doing this SBC, just because the reason I originally wasn't going to do it is because I didn't realise how cheap he was. Um, but now I'm going to actually, eventually, when the um, Okach or another Prime Icon SBC does come out, I'm going to submit this guy, because he goes for 40,000 coins and he's 91 rated. And players such as Higuain, who are 90 rated, they go for like 70, 80,000 coins. So when it does come down to completing those Prime Icon SBCs, this guy will save you quite a lot of coins. So getting to the final assist here, we play a really nice through ball there with the outside the foot through to Neymar. Neymar does a nice burber spin inside to the finesse shot. So guys, this is going to be the review. If you have enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.